Hi everybody, welcome to my channel. My name is Rachel and today I just wanted to share with you a few purchases I made recently from some small businesses. So today is my first video and is my first recording, so please bear with me for any video or audio issues or if things may be out of focus. This is the first time I've had to set up for a YouTube video and it was a bit difficult. So I'm just hoping that all goes well in this video. Okay, so the first thing I wanted to share with you guys was um, a package from Donna Bass Pens and she is one of my absolute favorite turners. And I haven't been into diamond painting for that long, but I have quickly gotten into the pen addiction and she's one of my favorites to order from. So I just got a package from her and I'm really excited to get into it. So let's get into it. So I'm going to not show you guys the other side because that's where my address and stuff is. And it came in this pretty rose gold metallic bubble mailer. I think it usually comes in pink or purple, I believe. But yep, this one came in a beautiful little rose gold bubble mailer. This here is her business card. And it says Bass Custom Arts LLC by Donna Bass. And it has all her information. So the way that I contact her and look at her stuff is through Facebook. Um, so if you're interested in any of her stuff and trying to get in contact with her, go through Facebook. But she does use Instagram as well as TikTok. And I don't use TikTok, so I didn't know that, but that's cool. So I'm going to set that to the side. Ooh, and then her husband, Justin, did mention that... They were adding some a little surprise to some of their packages, well, to all of their packages that have recently gone out. And so it looks like the little surprises are some candies. Ooh, and I have like this little candy drawer in my craft cart, so that's gonna go in there. And I love Kit Kats and Snickers, I love chocolate. So the first thing we see here are some multi-placers, and these are for all of the pens that I have ordered. There should be three in here, so let's go into it and see what we got. This is nice that they actually put it into this little clear baggie now because the first time I ordered, it just came wrapped inside the in the bubble wrap with the pens and they did easily get misplaced. Like if you already opened the package and you stuck them back in, they would like kind of fall out. So it's nice to have like a little designated area where you'd find your multi-placers in the package. All right, and so... These are all regular um, thickness multi-placers. It looks like I got two threes, one nine, I think this is a five or a six, and then one mini straightener, which I like this size for straighteners, so this is perfect for me. All right, and let's get into the package. Ooh, I'm so excited. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh okay so let's go ahead and move that out the way and actually there is another little packet of um, placers so this is just a single placer for they gave me a few extras I think or this one has like um yeah they gave me four and there's three I thought I have three pens but oh, I might have four okay so I might have four pens in here but yeah so these are the single placers for the pens I'm not gonna open that all right you guys so this is the first package that I'm opening up, and this is a honeycomb that I got, um, and the blank is made from Imagination Woods, so that's one that, that one looks like. This is my first, it's my second honeycomb, and so far, I feel like honeycombs aren't my favorite. Like, they look different once they're turned. Um, so yeah, this one's, this one's, like, the shape is really nice, and so that's, like, the style asked Donna to do for me but it's just like the the honeycomb blanks in general I feel like they're not my favorite but I do like that little purple part into inside the blank that one's really pretty and I like this silver color inside as well it makes it pop so that's nice sorry it's gonna take me a while so like everything is like unboxing so I haven't seen these yet and I'm like super excited so this is the next one. This is one that my brother actually got made for my sister-in-law. And this blank is also from Imagination Woods. This is so pretty in its own little way. I love these little rhinestones right here. 
These are Swarovski crystals and you can have these added on um, by Donna. And then inside right here are little Mickey confettis, but the but they're termed rat heads by Imagination Woods. So that's what that looks like. It has some clear and a little bit of cloudy inside the blank. And there's like a little bit of glitter. So hopefully my sister-in-law will like it because she is a little bit picky. <laughs> so I hope she likes it because it was a gift and my brother just thought to surprise her with some for Valentine's Day. But I like the color of the confetti. It's just that they're concentrated in little splotches of the areas. So it would have been nice if they were more like spread out. But um, you know, you never really know how the blank's going to turn out when you like create it. So they all happen to kind of settle in like little areas of the blank. But otherwise, I do like the color of the Mickey's. That's pretty. I have two in this package for me and oh my gosh! This is one that I won on one of her pen drops and it is so pretty. Donna had like a little sale, appreciation sale for her customers and this is the one that I got to win. Oh my goodness. I think this is like tinsel inside but it's kind of like a a uh, rainbowy color like there's different colors you can see inside of this like orange I see some yellow and some green oh my gosh this is so much prettier than I thought it was gonna be this is so nice and then it has the wood and one thing I'm noticing with the style of pens that I like is I like simpler colors and I love hybrids I love it when there's like wood and just like this resin or acrylic going on and I love these soft colors but they're still glittery so, oh my goodness, this is so pretty. I am so happy I won that one. Okay, moving on to the next. I can see that this is the second one of mine. Look how pretty. Oh my gosh. So this one is a multicolor pastel Mickey Mouse head or rat head. This one was, this blank was made by Sawdust Designs. And I asked Donna if she could just put some pastel rhinestones these are like not Swarovski but they are very shiny and so beautiful oh my gosh I am in love with like this one and my other pen and see like this Mickey pen has like dispersed Mickey heads so it looks really nice this way and I love the colors oh my gosh this is like Disney to me like bright colors and multicolors and this is just the adding like the special touch to the pen but yeah do you see how polished this pen is that's why I really do love Donna I love that we can send her our styles on how we like the pen or you can even ask her possibly to freestyle it if you don't know what style you want and then I love being able to add the crystals or the rhinestones or the beads um and then she also allows you to get rings made on captive rings so i have to show that in another video but i love the customization of these pens and she polishes them so good like this is so clear i can see from like one side to the other side and i mean some pens i've gotten are not this clear they're kind of sometimes cloudy or you can still see like some marks on them that need to be like polished better i have no idea but all of Donna's pens always come to me so perfectly and this is just an example of that. So this is another one my brother had made for my sister-in-law. And let's open it up and see. Ooh. Oh my gosh, this is so pretty. This is gorgeous. So um, I have a pen that my sister-in-law really likes and it's, it's an abalone as well. And it has these two crystal rings. So I'm going to show you my pen and show you um, the one my brother had made. So this is my original pen. And whenever my sister-in-law saw it, she always mentioned how she really liked it. And so I asked Donna, did she have a, another one of these or something similar? And she happened to have another abalone. So this is the one that uh, we got made for my sister-in-law. And as you can see, it is also very similar colors um, in abalone as to the one that I have. It just doesn't really have pink in it, but it does have this beautiful light blue and this yellow and clear opal color looking thing. 
so it's also really pretty but i feel like what makes this pen stand out is the two rings and the Swarovski crystals like these Swarovski crystals are popping like i don't even know if these are the same ones that i have on mine i guess they are or they're a little bit different like i feel like mine are more white and these ones are more like colorful like i can see more colors in them i can see green blue yellow pink these ones are more clear but i like these rhinestones better those are really pretty um well these crystals actually so that's what that looks like i hope my sister-in-law really likes it because my brother tried and it's really pretty like i think she's gonna like it it's simple in color but it still has that little oomph and in this little section it's clear with some glitters you can see a little bit of glitter and it also has like some little flakes inside like silver flakes i i feel like it would have looked nicer if they had just put glitter on the inside of the clear resin but it has that little those little glitter flakes which are fine it's still a really really pretty pen so yeah that was my order from donna bass and let's go ahead and get open something else okay this is the next one and it also just happened to come in a rose gold bubble mailer which is interesting because this is my first time i ever received a rose gold bubble mailer but this time i got two and one one delivery but this is from a store on etsy called country craft closet this is my first time ordering from them and i'm pretty sure it's pretty much cover minders that i ordered so let's open it oh okay so it comes bubble wrapped and let me just move all this other stuff out the way so okay that's the bubble wrap look how much bubble wrap that was a lot anyways so it comes in this pretty little baggy oh it's is this monopoly yeah it's like a monopoly um design little brown bag and it has a sticker that says thank you for supporting my small business all right so let's get into it Ooh, okay so the first thing i ordered was this little pad and it's like let me feel it Ooh, oh my gosh it's like sticky so that's the whole point it's a sticky little pad um and it's used to hold your tray in place so when you're diamond painting it won't like slip off the table or you know how sometimes your your tray like shakes where your drills fall out so this is trying to help it like stay in place so i've never tried one of these and i hope that it really does work which i think it will it's very sticky but because it's so sticky i feel like over time it's gonna like hold on to dirt and dust and like hair and eventually i feel like i'm gonna have to throw this away but hopefully it lasts me a good amount of time i just like will hate to see that there's like dust and everything on it but that's cute i love the color it's in a purple okay that's that all right oh everything comes like individually wrapped which is nice all right Ooh. so these are my little cover minders and i'm like so into diamond pens and cover minders lately and you'll see like basically this haul is cover minders and pens so this is a little parakeet um, cover minder. I used to have parakeets when I was little, so they're really special to me. I love birds. And so that's that one. And let's see. The magnets are good. Pretty strong. And I just love that. It's little, small parakeet cover minder. And then I have rabbits, so anything bunny related is a plus for me and this one's cute because it has a little mask on and it also has a bow that looks like hello kitty's bow and it's in pink so that's a little rabbit cover minder with a mask the next thing i got let's see oh <gasps> my dolphin cover minders okay let's open this so i guess i'm not gonna take them off of these little papers because i mean y'all could see them i'm like super into rainbows anything rainbow pattern so i got these two dolphins and i also love dolphins so i got these two and they also have those just those small little magnets on the back which are perfect adorable i love them i'm glad i like got both these colors because this one's like with the pink and this one has like the blue green and purple 
So that's nice. All right, the next thing is this little shell. And um, I have a Little Mermaid Diamond Art Club painting that I'm gonna, that I have in my stash. So some of the stuff I buy are like mermaid related cause I wanna use those type of cover minders on that painting. And this one's pretty, I thought it was really nice how it has glitter. It has like some star shaped confetti inside with a pearl and it's in the color teal. So that's super cute. Oh, she gave me a little free gift. That's so sweet. So I love it when shops do that. So nice. Okay, and let's see. It's like a little um, flower with a lot of confetti inside. So that's what that one looks like. It's in a blue flower. It has a bunch of confetti. So that was real sweet. And then I think the only thing left in here, here is her business card. So it says, thank you for supporting my business. And that's the shop name, Country Craft Closet. All right, and moving on. Oh my gosh, they're all stuck to my scissors. Okay, so the next one is this box. And let me just go ahead and open it off camera because it's all taped up. All right, y'all, well, Amy, who is the shop owner of this shop, the shop is called Nika's Designs. She taped the mess out of this box, so it was kind of hard to get into, but now we're in it. So this is gonna go into my candy drawer. So there's some Skittles, Lifesavers, Starburst. Dang, she put a lot of candy in here. Hubba Bubba Bubblegum, ooh. And then, ooh, she even put these little um, St. Patrick's Day stickers in there. And these are like that nice quality um, type of sticker. They're like vinyl that you can put on your water bottles and stuff and you, they won't get all messed up. So that's cute. And then this is the first thing. So this is a little um, cover minder that she makes and it is the theme like Ariel, but I guess they made them like look like tattoos. So it says siren at the bottom and it has Ariel with the fish. I always forget the fish's mm. name, flounder. But yeah, so that's that. That's so cute. And that's how the magnet looks on the back. And she makes these herself. So that's nice. And then, all right, yay. And then we're going to get into the cover minders I got. I'm so addicted to collecting these. It's not even funny. And Moana is one of my favorite princesses. So these are called clay minders that she sells. And she has a bunch of different ones you can purchase. And they come with magnets already on the back. So it's perfect. Um, and they're really strong magnets, magnets too. So this is the Moana one. And this one is supposed to be Ariel, but she has orange hair, but I still think it's super cute and I love all the little details. And it has a little rhinestone on her um, flower. That's adorable. And then here's a Despicable Me one. Oh my gosh, and these are the ones that I was really excited for. This one is a girl with black hair and she has the Little Mermaid dress on. And then this one is a girl with brown hair and she has her Winnie Pooh dress on with Eeyore on it. I love them, they're so cute. And all of these are handmade, so that's really crazy how like nice quality they are and so detailed. And then this one is Boo with her her Monsters Inc. dress. All right, and we have another little Boo. And this one she has a little a Sully plush with her. All right, the next is this one's not a famous character. This one's just a little girl with black hair, and she has a butterfly in her hand with a little butterfly dress. This one, oh, do I have this one? Let me see. Oh wow, I actually have this one already. So this one is a cow girl with a little cow purse. I did not remember that, but okay. And these are the cover minders that she makes. So I love Lisa Frank and I already said I do love everything rainbow. So these are her Lisa Frank cover minders. It has a little white tiger. 
This one, it has the bear within the Sunday. This one is the Lisa Frank rainbow heart. And this one's a Christmas one. So I guess it's like peace, love, and Santa. I like that. It has some plaid and cheetah. Cute. I'm going to save that for Christmas time. And then these are the other really popular images of Lisa Frank, which is those spotty Dalmatians and the cats. They're so clear too. I really like these because the print is very vibrant and colorful and they come out really clear as well. Alright, and then this one is um, the villains. I wish you could, I hope you can see like that detail. So these are the Disney villains. And then we have our Betty Boop, her head and her just posing. And I do have a Diamond Art Club Betty in my stash, so I'm going to use those for that painting. And then last but not least, we have the Rainbow Among Us. If you don't know what that is, this is like a game that you can play online with multiplayer. And I love how it's rainbow, I had to get that. And then the Lisa Frank Mermaid with a dolphin, or two dolphins. All right, so that was my purchase from Nika's Designs. The last thing I have here are actually replacement diamonds from my painting with Diamond Art Club. I'm gonna go ahead and open that. And I'm just gonna say how amazing Diamond Art Club's customer service is. So the other day I was diamond painting with my fiance and he mixed these two color drills and we don't like they're so close in color that it's super hard to uh, take them out and unmix them. So I asked Diamond Art Club because they have that guarantee, the oops guarantee, if they could send me these colors again and they did. And they literally responded to my email after three minutes of me sending it. And even before they emailed me, they already like updated my order to show that they were sending a couple out without me having to you know beg them and I really appreciate that so let's open it and I feel like these got to me so fast so yeah like their customer service was super amazing let's go ahead and open it all right sweet I hope these are enough because if you see this like this is a lot in here and these this is 743 and this is the packet of 743 they gave me it's like not that much so I still have a lot more to go and so I hope that's enough but this should be good for 742 that should be good enough the 743 that's a little sketch but either way they say they replace eight colors of your diamonds so if that's not enough, like I'll probably just have to reach out to them and I still have six more that they should be able to send me for that painting. Um, and it should be fine. But anyways, that is everything. I hope y'all loved seeing all my new cover minders, my clay minders, and my pins. So thank you guys for watching my first video on my channel. And I look forward to, to talking with you guys again and sharing all the new things. Bye!